Hello YouTube. As you can see I changed my keyboard to the People PC keyboard and I'm booting up <coughs> Fedora 14 at the present time. Now what I'm doing right now, I got a hard drive in for wiping. You just barely see it down there. That is one of the old silver Mac store hard drives from 1999. 6.4 gig hard drive with Windows 98 on it. And those old Maxter drives are not reliable at all. You have some that last forever. The ones that tend to last forever that I've had have been older Seagates and older Western Digitals. Unfortunately, Seagate is not as reliable as they used to be. Western Digital is more reliable than Seagate, mechanics-wise. So what I'm going to do here is I just deband the drive. So I'm going to see if the bad sectors have gone up. It had 22 when I first checked it. And after that, it had uh, <clears throat> 24 after I ran GNOME 2's disk utility um, self-checker. It does a little, just a short check on the disk. So let's go into uh, disk utility and just take a look at it. As you can see, there's the hard drive that's in this in my uh, workstation here, which is a 250 gigabyte drive. And there's the 6.4 gigabyte Mac store. There's a 90650U2. This will be. I was going to put this on uh, in my 98 box if the drive was good, but it says the drive's still good, but it's dying because it has a few bad sectors. Let's look at this <coughs> smart data. Yeah, this used to be 24 when I first plugged it in. It just keeps going up and up and up so this this drive is done unfortunately it looks like the magnetic media itself is starting to go bad mechanics wise it's fine though and yeah, unfortunately that yeah i just deband a drive that was dying so <clears throat> at least the drive can be put in safekeeping now which is good i'll show you guys the drive in a second there the machine is shut off and this is why i picked this case for a uh, workstation because it's got toolless hard drive base. So, and I got a Via. Um, I have a Via card in here that's both a SATA controller and PETA controller. This is why I chose this case because of the toolless design here. I can put both hard drives in there. And there's the Via card that has a PETA controller on it, so I can use IDE hard drives in this thing. It will not boot. This particular card does not boot. It's very similar to some of the RAID cards that uh, UXW Bill has. They don't boot, but they do do software RAID. <clears throat> Anyhow, I'll pull the hard drive out. So pull the power. Pull the IDE cable. Pull the lock. Let's take a look at this drive. Light. This is an old drive. It's silver all over. It's got very big chips on the bottom, along with really big di looks like really big diodes too. Um, <clears throat> Six point two gigabytes. The drive was manufactured in uh, September eleventh, nineteen ninety nine, and the warranty ended December two thousand two. <laughs> it's quite old. So, yeah. Poor old drive. Oh well. If anybody wants a dead hard drive, let me know. <laughs> That's a joke, because, you know, a dead hard drive's quite useless. I don't know what I'll do with it. I might just keep it for a, uh, for the platters, take the platters out and make wind chimes out of them or something. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, other than that, oh, I know what I can do with this. I can make a hard drive speaker. <laughs> Anyhow. Have a good one, everybody. Ciao.